everybody. So in this video, let's talk about real lightsabers. You heard me right, real lightsabers. So this is coming from StarWarsNewsNet.com. And I want to say, if you are a Star Wars fan, you should definitely check out this website. They do phenomenal work, whether you're into the films, the TV shows, the comics, the novels, whatever it is, video games, whatever it is, this site has it all in regards to Star Wars. I absolutely love this site. It's a great resource. But um, I don't want to digress too far, but this particular article caught my eye. And I wanted to go over it with you guys. So it says here, retractable real lightsaber unveiled at Disney Parks virtual event. So it says here, today, Josh Diomaro, chairman of Disney Parks Experiences and Products, hosted a virtual presentation for Disney Parks. Quote, a special look inside Disney Parks as Attraction Magazine relates that Demaro teased that there was more coming to Disney Parks very soon and that, quote, fans never know what they'll come up with next. He really meant that because in the final moments of the presentation, he took out a lightsaber hilt and ignited it. He said, quote, it's real. And the meeting was over. Holy beep <laughs> okay this is awesome absolutely awesome now of course there's no video or anything like that um but from what i understand this lightsaber is extremely impressive it looks completely legit um there's no word on exactly how disney is going to utilize these real lightsabers like in the parks whether they're only going to be for maybe cast members, you know, performance cast members, or maybe they'll be for sale. Maybe you'll be able to buy one of these real lightsabers at like Savi's workshop in Galaxy's Edge. There's no word on that. I'm going to opt for the latter though. Um, if Disney's going to spend all this money on research and development to create real lightsabers, uh, chances are they're going to want to make some of that money back and they will make a total metric ton of money if they were to sell these, I mean, can you imagine like during like D23 Expo, all the Star Wars fans coming over to the Disneyland Resort and buying real lightsabers, how much money Disney would make on something like that? It would be insane. Absolutely insane. So I do think Disney's going to eventually market these to the public. Um, but I also think they're going to utilize the technology for their shows. You know, if you have uh a show with like you know say kylo ren or darth vader or whoever um to have these real lightsabers available to to the cast to utilize in like performances and stuff would be really really something special um there's a there's a huge amount of potential there so this is a game changer you guys a total game changer i mean as a star wars fan any star wars fan the dream has <laughs> always been to own your own lightsaber. It, it, it's, it's like the pinnacle of nerddom. Uh, it's, it's, it's real lightsaber. And then on a very close number two is a hoverboard from like back to the future part two. Right. I mean, those are the two like major things on every nerd's wish list. So this is absolutely phenomenal. I, I can't wait. Um, there's no timeline of course, as to when these will be available or if they'll be available. We don't know any of that. It was very vague. Um, but I think that in the next few years, we will definitely see these on the market. I think that that's the goal. They want they want to sell these at Galaxy's Edge. They know it, it'll be an extremely successful product. Um, it ties in beautifully with Savi's workshop and things like that. So, man, this is this is incredible news. But what do you guys think about the prospect of real lightsabers? A real lightsaber? Um, would you buy one? It like, you know, I'm sure it'll be like a thousand dollars or some insane price, but would you buy one? Um, you know, what are your feelings on something like this? Uh, I would love to hear from you guys. Also, what are your thoughts on Disney utilizing this technology for their shows or Star Wars shows at like bot to galaxy's edge? What are your thoughts on that? I would love to hear from you guys. Check out starwarsnewsnet.com. They are an awesome Star Wars website. And as always, may the force be with you. Bye-bye.